back, Dr. Mona. Three, one, two, three, Dr. Dr. Mona. Mona. Hi, this is Dr. Mona Hanna. I'm a pediatrician in Flint, Michigan, a professor at Michigan State University, and I am so inspired by the activism and the energy and the passion here in Imperial Beach. Yes, there is a problem at the border, but all the ingredients of the solution are right here. And I encourage anyone out there who cares, who wants to make a difference, to be part of this movement because the change is coming. I can see it because of all the amazing stakeholders and leaders and activists and scientists. All these people are already at the table, but we need you. We need everybody to be part of this movement because it is not okay to have an environmental crisis right here in our backyard. We can do better. Hi, my name is Kapili Pasa and I am the Waterfront Manager at YMC Camp Surf. Today I had the honor and privilege of facilitating the conversation between our community, the Mayor Aguirre, Senator Padilla and Dr. Mona on the advocacy and efforts around water quality and the Tijuana pollution crisis. This issue is really important to me because as a leader of YMCA Camp Surf, I get the honor and privilege of training our ocean lifeguards on safety and keeping our kids and campers safe around the water. Lately, we haven't been able to do that because of the access of the water. Um, today, we really got to hear about the efforts that are um, going on, I guess, sort of behind the scenes in our legislation um, with our elected officials. We got to see the advocacy efforts of Senator Padilla presenting a state of emergency to Congress. We got to see the research that is happening with a similar issue. Um, Dr. Mona wrote a book about Flint, Michigan and how their water source and their air quality is being affected and endangering their kids and their future generations of communities. And that story is really parallel to what is happening here in Imperial Beach. Um, Dr. Mona's story is a story of hope. Through very hard work and advocacy, she's able to make these changes that are now nationwide. Um, it's amazing to see her share that with us, to share that battle, and to encourage the community members to keep on fighting the good fight, to keep on being the squeaky wheel so we can actually see results.